welcome to another video and today I thought I'd do a little deck for my deck project uh, for the next month or so which is uh, the brand new archetype uh, Sotella Knights um, these came out in the Duelist Alliance and I've just thought I'd be back from the sneak peek and I thought I would show you what my little project is going to be and um, this is the Sotella Knight deck is my project uh, and yeah I'm going to show you like, the build I have right now. Um, obviously, definitely not complete. Far off being complete. Um, I have got a Deneb and Ash Thylum, Ash Slime, whatever it is, in the post. But I'll be updating this deck every week just to show you how the progression goes. But anyway, for the monsters, I've got right now. I've got one Satellite Deneb. Hey, Satellite. Oops, Stellanite Deneb is the stratos of the deck. Uh, when it's summoned, you can add a Stellanite monster from your deck to your hand, except Stellanite Deneb. And you can only use effect of it once per turn. Yeah, they all have the like, same last two lines. Like, you, can all, you can do whatever except using the, the same Stellanite monster. And you can only use the effect of that Stellanite monster once per turn. Yeah, so, yeah, so Stellanite Deneb is like the new stratos, and I've got yeah, one on the one in the post and one person at my locals has got one for me. So obviously you've got to run three straddles. Yeah, then next if got three Stellanite Vega. Um this is all these cards basically combo together. And I'll show you like the com one of the main combos at the very end. Yeah, and what Stellanite Vega does is when it's summoned, you can special summon a Stellanite monster from your hand. And you can you can't special summon Vega and you can only use a fed of Vega once per turn. Yeah. Uh, next up is the Telenite uh, Altair. Uh, this is like rare. The, the only like um, there's only a one Ultra, which is the Telenite Deneb, and then there's a Super Telenite Ashline, whatever it's called. And then Telenite Altair is rare. Then the other three two are uh, common, just so you know. And what Telenite Altair does is when it's summoned, target a Telenite monster in your graveyard, special summon it, face up defense position. And you can't target Altair, and you can only use one Altair effect once per turn. And only um, Telenite monsters can attack. Hey, well, Telenite monsters can attack, which means there's probably going to be more in the archetype. Uh, next up is 3 uh, Telenite Unukali. And what this does is, uh, when it's summoned, uh, you can send a Telenite monster from your deck to the graveyard. Except Unukali, and you can only use one really Unukali effect once per turn. So yeah. Yeah, so I'm only running these 10 right now, because I've only got these 10. These are the cards that I pulled from the sneak peek, yeah, or traded from the sneak peek. Yeah, I pulled the Safira, the ultimate ritual thing, the ultimate rarity, yeah, and traded that for Deneb. And well, the Safira's only worth like £10, and then the Deneb's worth about 25 So, yeah, I feel sort of bad, but I don't. Yeah, next up is 3 Shining Angel. Yeah. Shining Angel is really good because your Deneb and Vega are both under 1500, which means, yeah, you can crash into this if you want to get a free plus to crash, get your Deneb, get its effect, attack over, whatever, or else it's light so it works with the deck. Then I've got one Photon Thrasher and one Honest because everything in here is basically light. Except from these next couple of monsters, uh, we've got two summoner monk because we have we do play like a lot of spells, uh, so you know there are some useless ones. The upstart goblins are sort of useless, uh, not useless, but you know what I mean. And uh, yeah, this is counted as summoning your stellar monster, so they get their effect. And then we've got three goldenberg. It's a warrior, works with the deck, and because all stellar eight monsters are warrior. Yeah, so it's a photon thrasher and stuff. When it's summoned, you switch to defense, you special summon a telenate monster from your hand. So that's how you get their pluses off. So that was the monsters for the spells. We've got three mystical space typhoon, three upstart goblin, finally got no play set, uh, two soul charge, two duality, two rota. Like I said, they're all warriors, so maybe they'll run it. Uh, one Satellanite Skybridge. This card is actually really good. 
Yeah, I would you to get multiple free pluses in one turn. Yeah. You basically summon a Satellite Monster. Activate this. That Satellite Monster that was summoned gets its effect, so if it's a Deneb, get the get Deneb's effect. Activate this. Return Deneb to the deck. Special summon a uh, Unukali. Send Deneb to the graveyard. And then if you have like an Altair in your hand next turn, get the Deneb back. You know, get free pluses. Then finally, we won. We play one Satellite Alpha. Um, Satellite Alpha. Alpha is absolutely rubbish, but it gives a good 500 attack and defense boost. So it's good in that sense. And also, it's one of the Satellite cards I have. Then uh, for the next to the traps, uh, I've got one of the new uh, Counter Trap, which is actually really good. It's ultra rare. What the way Satellites are like height are the same as like the main artifacts like the trap cards are ultra some of the spell cards are common and then like the monsters are like mixed between common rare and super and ultra and then ultra and ultimate for the Xyz although the Xyz is in secret and ghost as well uh, but anyway this card what, what Stella Nova Stella Nova Alpha does that's quite hard to say it's basically a solemn judgment for anything uh, so basically when a spell trap or monster effect is activated, you can send one face up to tell an eight monster you control to the graveyard, negate the activation, and if you do, destroy that card, and then you get a drawing card. So, you plus by negating something, then you plus by drawing something. So yeah, it's pretty good. Then we play Bottomless, two Call of the Haunted for summoning your tell an eight monsters, and then two Fiendish Chain, because you can. And then with the extra deck, extra deck is far from being uh, complete. I have forgotten a couple of cards, uh, but anyway, okay, on to this. Since everything is like warrior, I've got Hero Chamber Excalibur, Blade Armor Ninja, you know, for warrior OTKs, since they are good. Uh, Castellar Omega, light, everything's light basically. 101, Cowboy, Emerald, Pappy, 50, Dyer, Maystroke, 80. Generic Peril and number 102 star set of Sentry. Um, this is good, but this would be dropped instantly for the Satellanite Vixies. Don't know what it's called. But yeah, guys, if you enjoyed, like, comment, subscribe, and yeah, like I said, this will be updated every week or so, probably every week, uh, with the new cards I pick up from locals and whatever uh, for it, and yeah, I will. See you guys in the next one. Bye.